Hi guys, Yuri here again. Welcome to YB Plays Music. Today I'm gonna show you guys how to play the chord E on guitar. So we already did a couple of chords the last couple of weeks, being the A, B, C and D chord last week. So today we're gonna do the E chord and next week will be the F chord. It's not a hard one at all, actually. It's one of the easier ones in my opinion because we're gonna play all the strings. So no restrictions there. Um, and it's pretty easy position to hold the fingers in. So we're gonna start off to place our uh, middle finger on the second fret of the fifth string. Then we're gonna place our ring finger just below that on the second fret of the fourth string. And then finally our index finger on the first fret of the third string. And then we're gonna just play all the strings. That's the E chord. But I always give you guys a second option and maybe a third. In this one I'm just gonna give you a second option. I'm gonna explain why. So for this one we're gonna start off with the second option of the D chord from last week which was this one. And we're gonna move up two frets down the arm. One, two in the same position and we get the E chord. All right, that's the same, but higher. The reason that I'm not going to give you the third option like I usually do, although you could do that, but then we have five frets down the arm and then we get this position here, but that's actually exactly the same like the one over here, but 12 frets up, so just an octave higher. And you're probably not gonna use this position very much. So you could do that, but uh, it's not going to be that uh, usable a lot of the times. So those are the options that you have for the basic E chord on guitar. Now, sometimes you can have different uh, options on which fingers you use in different positions. I told you that with the A chord, you could choose to use middle ring and pinky finger or index middle and ring finger. You have that with a couple of chords as well, which I didn't show you always, but you have that option. Like here, uh, I told you to use middle ring and index finger, but you can use your middle ring and pinky finger as well for this one. It just depends on which chord comes before it or after that, uh, or which is more comfortable for you. So guys, I hope you learned something again today. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share the video. And don't forget, I also have reaction videos and music videos for you to check out. Thank you very much, guys. See you guys next time. Bye.